Hey everyone, welcome back. In today's video, I'm going to show you how you can add USDC into your Phantom Wallet. So the first step is to obviously unlock your Phantom Wallet. And once you've done that, you would be able to see the different tokens that are in your account. When it comes to USDC, you wouldn't be able to find it in this list unless you have purchased it prior. So, however, if you had already purchased USDC and you're still not seeing it in this list, it might be because the toggle is turned off. So how you can manage to fix that is by selecting manage token list and you would find it in this list. So you go ahead and turn the toggle on, which is found right next to USDC. So with that, you would have it fixed and you would have USDC in your list. However, as I mentioned earlier, you would still need to buy USDC to have it displayed in your account. So you do have two options. You can directly purchase it by using your debit or credit card, or you can deposit it from another wallet. So with the first option to buy it by using your credit card, you can just simply select the buy button on the right side of your screen. When it comes to the list of tokens, you can simply search USDC on the top search bar and you would have the different types of usdcs that would be available in different networks it's completely up to you which one you select whether it's in the solana network or the ethereum network but for the sake of this tutorial i'm going to go ahead and select one of them and proceed to the next step on the next step you would be provided with the chance to specify how much money you're willing to spend on purchasing usdc and i'll go ahead and proceed with 100 dollars which would mean I would be purchasing $100 worth of USDC. And by selecting credit and debit card, I would be provided the different facilitators within this process. So when it comes to providers, if you have any account with these three, you can go ahead and use them and proceed to the next step. As you can see, however, the lowest price for this instance is with MoonPay. So I would definitely suggest using MoonPay. And by selecting MoonPay and proceeding to the next step, that's it you have purchased usdc and it's going to automatically reflect on your token list so with that you've added usdc to your phantom wallet if you opt for the second option and you want to send it from another wallet and you need any crypto exchange you can use bybit and you will find the link attached down below thank you and we will see you on the next one